Hey everyone, welcome to today's video. Today I'm joined with my best friend Anne, and today we are doing our Christmas present swaps. Now we've done it a little different this year. We thought we'd make it a little bit more fun and purposeful. So if you would like to see what Em got for me, that'll be over on her channel. And right now I'm gonna share with her what I bought for her. So we agreed on a list, we've given each other little tasks for each present because we want them to be meaningful. Now I'm just gonna kind of go for it, okay. not a particular order. So we're gonna start with something you love. Now all of these are the same. You done exactly the same things with me, haven't you? And it was quite hard, we were sat there and we were like, oh my gosh, there's almost like too many different ideas. It was quite hard. Also, this is so aesthetic, the way you've wrapped it versus <laughs> mine, which is loud and exciting and Disney themed. But I'm, I'm afraid that you've gone overboard. Like, Em was kind of explaining to someone yesterday what she got for me and I was low-key freaking out. Oh my gosh, you know I <laughs> something you love. Second skin tights or granny tights and everyone say on Instagram. <laughs> but they're so good, it means you can still get your legs out in winter and not freeze. And these are my favourite ones, the Calcedonia. Oh, well, I've never ever actually owned any Calcedonia, so thank you guys. So there you go. Gift. I'm very useful. Is that accurate? That something is so accurate. <laughs> I love it. Oh my gosh, I'm excited. Okay. Well, that's the vibe for every gift. <laughs> Alright, next up, let's do, okay, something you always forget. Now, now, I didn't just want to get you something, something you forget, forget. that you love. I wanted to get you like my favorite versions of these things. Or I'm like, what do I always forget? <laughs> we go on so many trips together. We've literally traveled the world together at this point, and I'm like, oh. Oh my gosh, I always have to borrow your hand sanitizer. Yes, and this is a foam one. Oh, okay, good. So I thought you'd keep it in your car because it's a great size. That's great. I keep this in my car and it's a game changer. I was really good with hand sanitizer and then I just stopped remembering it because I was like, oh. And then I was like, can I borrow yours? So thank you, that's great. Of course. Okay, next up. Oh, this is so tricky because there's so many good things. I'm going to save something for us to do together for last. Okay. Because that's the one I'm most excited about. I have a feeling that we might have bought each other the same thing. Oh no. Imagine. And I feel like I've, I've read your mind. Okay, like, so this is a snack for when you get hangry. Now, this would have been really easy. I could have just gotten you a protein bar, but I wanted to get you something a little niche. So you've mentioned this before. So Emily and I are always hangry. And to be honest, we know when each other's hangry. And we just say, let's not speak to each other until we've had some food. It's and yeah, we're like so different sorry. people when we've eaten. Okay. Um, oh. oh my gosh, I love it. I saw <laughs> Tiff put this on a TikTok. And oh my gosh, it is so... Good. You mentioned it was so we went hot. past. I went to eight it's different places and couldn't. Oh, I had to get on a card. Yes, I had to order an avocado order just to get it. Avocado. <laughs> is that and good? It, no, that was amazing. I thought that was a bit more. Bad. I thought that was a bit more fun than a protein um, it's bar. It's useful. It's delicious. You can make cookies out to <laughs> them. Thank really? You. Yeah, you just blend, blend it together. Put some like banana in it or some milk, and then you make cookies. I've never tried Run that. cookies. Okay, so next up, I'm gonna give you something you never knew you needed. I've got two. That's number one and oh, that's number how two. How lucky am I? I couldn't choose and I think you need both of them. Something you never knew you needed. Um, I hope you didn't watch my vlog and see this because you commented on the vlog. I commented on the vlog but I didn't watch the whole thing. Okay, good. I only watch vlogs when I want my Peloton. That's my rule. Okay, well you probably didn't reach as far into the vlog. I then, didn't. So. Yeah, because someone commented and I was like, okay, I need to not finish watching that vlog. Yeah. So these are mini perfume decanters. Oh my goodness, I honestly thought that they were mini something else. <laughs> they look really naughty. Um, no. <gasps> so you. How amazing. Yeah, so at the bottom here, you push onto your perfume and you can decant it. So I could put like my flower bomb in there or my Joe Malone, all of my favorite. In your bag and it won't weigh you down. <laughs> oh my gosh, thank you. That is genius, particularly for travel. I use my, oh my gosh, I love the gold day. one. Again, I saw someone talking about these in Selfridges the other day and she basically like went into Selfridges and used one. Really? Yeah, so I think you're allowed to do what, that. What, filled it up? She filled it up in Selfridges. I think that's illegal. Please I think do that's illegal. Do that. Don't do Please that. don't get arrested. And this is the other thing. I that's don't so own one of these, but my mum does and I always use it. And I was like, I don't know if you mummy kind of likes it. Oh my gosh, I'm excited. It's like Christmas has come early and I'm so lucky. Also, this packaging is just stunning. It's very Anne Chantelone aesthetic. It is. I thought oh. I'd go with that. It's oh, okay. This is amazing. amazing. You know who would love this? Matt. My yes. boyfriend will be obsessed with this because he loves lint rollers. This is so good. So, on your knitwear, when things start to bobble oh, up, my gosh, and also, even this dress right now. Yeah. Well, it's so easy to use. Never so knew quick. I needed that. Never even knew that existed. You learn something new every day. And I promise you, you will end up using it all the time. <laughs> I feel, I feel like we're being very, this is very... We're being very... Is, yeah, like, is yours a similar vibe or no? Is yours funny? Mine is quite funny. Yeah, okay, fine. I'm a comedian <laughs> out of the friendship group. You're today. Today. I'm always there making jokes out of myself. Your desert island essential. 
So if, if you were to ask me what my desert island essential is, I don't know, I'd probably say Elizabeth Arden 8 hour cream. No, 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 you'll see this and then you'll change my I would say a protein bar because I always get hungry. Okay guys, anyone that knows Emily and I knows that we always have these in our bag. I got you addicted to them. I even got our American friend Tara addicted to them. We walk everywhere. everywhere. And these apparently don't exist in the US. And she was like, Emma, I got a blister. And I was like, go get some compies. And I got her some of these and now she's like, Em, I've stopped up in England. They don't sell anything like it in the US. They're amazing. They are, like, I should work for them. But you know the problem is, Em doesn't wear proper shoes to walk. So I will walk in, like, sandals yeah, for, like, 20 flat, miles. Flat sandals. And then I wonder why I've got, like, foot problems. Yeah, we need to, like, pick a pet. Well, that was amazing. Yeah. That was really good. Good, you. right? I have yeah, London was, trainers. I just thoughtful. don't wear them. I just, it popped into my head and I was like, this is... Perfect. Even I forgot how obsessed I am with them because <laughs> no. I'm so used to it. Thank you. Okay, something that, ooh, what do we go? Oh, yes, I like this one. Something to pick you up when you need it, number one, and Aww. something to pick you up when you need it, number two. Aww. I don't think you have any idea what this is until you open <gasps> Oh my gosh, we, okay, it's a lush, scrubby body butter. Sorry to, to shout, I think I just broke anyone's eardrums if they're on listening through my um, headphones. Emily and I went into Lush the other day in Stratford Westfield and I was saying to Emily, I need to find this body butter. I've used it for years, it smells so good. And we found it. Guys, comment if you know what this smells like because we don't even know, do we? We can't even figure out what this smell is. Well, you say that, I actually asked. You asked that and maybe open that one next. Oh, guys, it's like a chocolatey vanilla. Shea butter. Shea butter. Oh my gosh, I love it. And it's like a massage bomb. It takes me back to my youth. I think this is like an exfoliating. Oh my gosh, you got This me. is the scent. It's Honey Day Wash the Kiss. It is. I oh asked. Oh my gosh. And I was like, what else do you have? And they said they had that. Oh, so that is so nice. And that lifts me up. That is such a nice gift. Thank you so much. You listen to everything I say. I, you know, I'm going to admit it. I've had a note on my phone since about September of little things you mentioned, like the prep granola. I need to do that. That's a great idea for gifts, guys, if people mention stuff. Well, you're so hard to buy for. Because what do you buy someone that has everything? And... I mean, but to be fair, you do forget everything. I forget everything. So that I'm a scatter brain. I am a scatter brain, but I've learned to love that. Like it yeah. makes me who I am. Okay, so <laughs> something you never buy yourself. Oh no, this is going to be something ridiculously embarrassing. There's nothing rude. There's nothing There's rude. There's nothing rude. What is this? <laughs> I'm so sorry for your eardrums. Ron Pre Heroes, who is the greatest? Top Trumps. I am obsessed with the F1. It's, oh my god, the camera's falling. Is it? Yeah, look. Sorry about that, we had a little uh, camera issues. Okay, yeah, Em loves Formula One, basically. She loves Charles Leclerc. This is a new love, I have to say. Like, I used to watch it like 2014 with my brother and now I am like back into it because it went to Singapore and I actually watched it live. And I watched so much F1 on the TV before going to like binge it and get into it and this is a great gift. I mean, a Charles Leclerc cutout would have been better, but I'm not mad about that. This I is mean, great. Formula One's something that I grew up with in my household, so I love that it's a new love for you. I think it's, it's so nice. Happy. I think there's nothing wrong with people finding like new hobbies and new things to like. No, I think really love. Okay, next up. This is probably the most rogue. Something for the new year. So my, my vision with this is that maybe once a month or whenever you have time, maybe you can do something. There's gonna be something like breathe. Yoga. Relax. No, no, because I knew you would absolutely never use it, so I didn't do that, but it would have been a sensible um, thing. I would have used Pilates. Oh my goodness. How am I meant to get into this? You've done such a stellar job on the wrapping. So much so that I can't actually get in those. Oh, I'm seeing a book. I'm seeing. <laughs> You're just going everywhere, all over the floor. I'm a scrapped brain. Oh my goodness, it's a sourdough book. Close, but I knew you were going to make sourdough toast. every week. I mean, I like to make sourdough, but that was a lockdown thing. Bread, toast, crumbs, recipes for no need loaves, and meals to save at every slice. Because what's my one true love? Bread. bread. So they're recipes to go with bread. So there's oh, this is yeah, oh, shakshukas. Oh. There's like risottos. That is insane. And I just thought you'd actually probably do that. And I, I do love cooking and baking. It's just having the time. Yeah, and you always I have bread in the house. I love making my own sourdough. It's just finding the time. So that is amazing. Thank you so much. Of course. All right. Next up, something to make you feel great. Number one, and something to make you feel great. Number two. Oh, mine is not as well organized as this. Mine just kind of says what it is. <laughs> I mean, being here with you makes me feel great. I mean, it should. <gasps> oh, she knows. You know me far too well. I am absolutely, I mean, I'm obsessed with all chocolate. Even just Cadbury is fine for me. But toys, tiny toys, Christmas mix. 
This is the most squealy video ever, so I'm so excited. Thank you so much. Oh, I feel I'm like sweat. Tony's is a new love for me. Yes, Tony's salted caramel, guys. The one in the orange is just insane. <gasps> is this the milk one? Milk dark. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, it's just, it's a Mike and Forty Wonka. The bars are so special and luxurious. It makes such a good gift. But not so fussy. much. It's actually good chocolate without being too much. But maybe this isn't what I got you as well. I don't no. know. So, something for us to do together. We are experienced friends, but also we're busy friends. And the only thing that I can guarantee you will do and not cancel and turn up is something food related. Or workout related. Or workout related. And I will not be doing a blaze class or anything intense. So I was not going to book that. And also, do you know how hard it was trying to find something that you've either never done or we've never done together? We so need to make a bucket list. We need to make a list of the things that we want we to do. We do. So you've been here before. I've been here before, but we've never been here together. And it's something that is very special to us because of where it is and we can make a day of it if we want to, but if we don't have to, you know, I, I think this is a lovely one for us oh, to do together. This makes me feel like, I don't know. I spent a long time thinking, I think this is a fun one, but still Are you me to meet um, Charles Leclerc? <laughs> no! Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, I love it! Yes. We're going to Chai Wu at Harris. Yes. One of the best restaurants I've ever been to. I've never been to together. That's so nice. Well, I just thought Harrods. We're at Harrods every week, so it's not going to ruin our schedule. No, we can pop in. Yeah, we can pop in. Oh we can do it together. That's like a golden ticket. Yeah. Well, Merry Christmas. So I really hope you love all your bits. It, and everything is so thoughtful and useful. And we're definitely playing. We do. On New Year's Eve. Yeah. Absolutely. I just didn't want to fill your home with clutter, and that was the whole point. Yeah. yeah you don't need stuff that we don't need. This is all delicious things or things I can use. <laughs> useful gorgeous gifts thank you so much of course well guys if you enjoyed it a thumbs up would be amazing if you want to see what Em got from me i'm about to open them now head over to her channel and i will see you next time there will be another video for the new year if you didn't know i'm doing vlogmas so that will be linked down below and i'll see you next time bye, bye.